like it's, not bad. It's, not, it's not really, really it's a lot of jazz or anything. It's just enough. Yeah, I like the other two. This is a little cool. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm saying. But it's not really, really out there, though. Yeah, this seat is going to pop. That's a little somewhat behind that, too. Okay. Limited edition Jones. Alright, where is the preferred knowledge you do, huh? What do you want to know on that? Right. What is popping? Your boy Rod really cool on the way back to me, the whole bowl of muscle I am. Oh. 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 So I said, well, I'll stop by on the way back home and check out the new fragrance called Sudute. Sudute by Perfumology. Sudute. So I'm going to put my nose on it. Sudute. And then there's a couple of new Iki Rose that are out as well. What's going on, Warren? Anything good with you, brother? I got five people in the house, only three likes. Y'all got to give me five likes for five people. Intellectual property is going on here. You must pay for the intellectual property by hitting the like button. And subscribe while you're at it, okay? So here we go. Sudete. It's right now, like six years over there, too. It's old, but it's still hot. Because I'm on the skin. Let it ride a little bit. This is super brand new. Like, anybody has it yet? Anybody ship it out to anybody? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so it's over here. Yeah, it's for sale. Dr. Brown. Okay. For sale for the box 85 with the box 95. They don't have boxes. But they don't have none. Ooh. Only available without the box right now. Only available without the box right now. A lot of people say they get leather off, off, off the, you know, they get leather right away. Right? There's some fruit in here too. Yes, definitely some fruit. I get the fruit all in Coconut wood. Mmm. Mm hmm. Mmm. Yeah, I definitely get the, I get the fruit. I'm getting the fruit. Fruity. Yeah, I smell the suede too. Or leather. Okay, where y'all go? What was this five people in here again? One? Yeah, there's a lot of spices. Oh, I guess some of you think I'm doing guitar videos. No, it's not a guitar video. Mm -hmm. Look at the doggone thing, and it says what this is. It's about the juices. Tyler and Musk up. What's going on, baby? What's going on, Ace? I'll holler at your boy. On vacation next week on the 18th. Have no idea what I'm gonna do, man. My money got kind of low because I, I, I bought too many guitars. But we'll see. If I'm coming down that way, I'll definitely let you know, bro. I was trying to get to Ocean City, but probably won't make that either. Probably the next vacation. This is nice. I like it on the skin more than I like it on paper. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's better on my skin. I smell pineapple. I smell some pineapple in here or something. Any pineapple in there? Um, I'm not sure. I smell piney apples. It's like pineapples. I like that. Sauté is nice. Make sure I let it away on my skin a little more. Shot. I think there's like passion fruit or something like that. It does. There's something. Fruit. There's something sweet. Yeah, it's definitely sweet fruit. fruit. Okay. Passion fruit. Okay. I'm thinking. Um, I like it. I like it. a lot of spices and stuff. The spices are what gives it that sweet leather. Oh, you think that's what it is? Okay, okay. Yeah, there's not actual like leather or anything like that. No, not actual leather. No, it just comes out like that. Oh, okay. I got you. I got you. But there's no leather or or suede, yeah. mm -hmm. actually. It smells good. I like it. I like it. I heard some people already picked this up too. Uh, it's good. That's good. I like it. It's definitely different from the other uh, three. It's a different take. It's more fruity. Not gourmandy, but definitely a little orientally, if you ask me. La Duke, a new one by Ikeo, Ikero. Okay, let's go with this and see what we got going on here. The La Duke is definitely different. Mm -hmm. I like it. I like the La Duke. Yeah, La Duke is nice. Check it out. La Duke by Icaro. La Duke. Like that one. Okay. 
Next, we're going to spray, uh, what's this one right here, bro? I can't even tell the name. Which one? Ann Lynn. Ann Lynn? Ann Wynn. Ann Wynn, okay. Yeah, Ann Wynn. Ann Wynn. You can roll again. Let's go. Because I'm going to get in prepared to him, to prepare, but I don't know. If these new ones out, I'm glad I kind of waited. Looks like you got a couple more on the website. This kind of reminds me of Chocolate Neck, though. It's got the chocolate egg vibe. I smell a little bit of different, but it's not identical. Of course, it's not. And this is Rose of Venus, which as soon as I smelled this, I like this. Which kind of crazy, but I ain't smell roses. Rose of Venus. How you doing? Hello. Okay. Yeah, Rose of Venus, and I smell a little bit of. It's like I'm smelling like. Oh, Rose of Venus is uh, it's got rose in my white musk. Linden, Linden, Ivy, Bergamot, Caramel, Rum, Incense. Rum. Yeah. I know there's alcohol in here. Rum. I just know which one it was. Yeah. Rum yeah, this is nice. This is nice right here. Rose of Venus is nice. Yeah. And of course, gentlemen, if it says rose, it does not mean you can't wear it. This means that you're going to wear it. Especially this one. It smells good. Really good. I put it on my skin. And a lot of oil, of course. The oil content in here is crazy, man. Yeah. The oil content is ridiculous. So, those are the three. So, perfect melody. Y'all know what that is. I like it. Pineapple. So, so now we're gonna go to electro mousse. Okay. Now electro mousse. I don't have any electro mousse. I'm gonna be honest because they're a little expensive. They kind of expensive. Like, I'm gonna keep it real. I'd rather buy a guitar. Anything over 200, I'm buying a guitar. You know what I'm saying? Well, not necessarily. Anything over 300, I'm buying a guitar. You know what I'm saying? I don't know, I don't know about Ray. Guitar gonna be around forever if I don't sell it. Oh, okay. Disappear sometime. But let's give it a try. Electomus, the new one. And I forgot the name of it. What's the name of the new Electomus? Mercurial cashmere. Mercurial cashmere. Mercurial cashmere. Mercurial. 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 Let's spray it. Okay. Yeah, it does. Okay, Mercurial cashmere. Got to get it dry. Now, when it's this complex, you got to let it dry down. There's no way I'm going to find out what's going on with something this complex. Yeah. Right off the nip on the, on, on the nozzle. Okay, so. Yeah, it's good, though. It's definitely good. Okay, it's definitely okay. It's good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. This is rose. That rose. Yeah, that rose is great. That rose is hot. Hey, what's going on there, Trinkle Toes? Charles Alexander in the house. How you doing, Charles? The new Ikea rolls, there's three new Ikea rolls. I like all three of them. I mean, the one kind of gives, reminds me of Chaka Cognac. Yeah, the chocolate. That's the passion. That has passion for the chocolate. Yeah. yeah. But the Anwin, I mean, yeah, the Anwin, yes, the one comes with the chocolate one. But the other two, the um, La Duke and uh, the, the rolls, nice, nice, nice. What are the prices on those? Uh, like 120. The rolls is 130. Uh, one's 120, one's 125. Okay, so 120, 125, and 130. The rolls is 130, and it should be because it does smell good. Yeah, the rolls 130, the Duke 125, and the Anne Lynn 120. Okay, yeah, 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 definitely. Yeah, that, yeah. Ikaro. 50 mil too? Great price. But you guys know 50 mils nowadays go anywhere from uh, 175 to even 215. They raise the prices. Reliable. Yeah, reliable, by radio. Reliable, by radio. They're going up. You oh, yeah, 195. Yeah, 205. Yeah, everything's going up. Everything's going up. So, uh, yeah, yeah. And 50 mil of uh, a Frederick Mall, you're talking about somewhere around 260 to 275 for Frederick Mall. So yeah, yeah, it's going up, bro. Going up. Time to go more artisan. Yeah, yeah, more niche. And also more internet. Yeah. <laughs> it comes down to it. Anybody being a reviewer now, so yeah, things going up. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, that's, that's, that's good. I like that. I like it. Can I get a sample of these two? We have a guest here. What's your name? Stephanie. Stephanie is here visiting perfumology. Yeah, I think my videos is all about perfumology. This is what you're reviewing. Okay, absolutely. Yeah, Stephanie is walking by the camera. She thought she said, "Oh, sorry, I'm sorry, don't be sorry." That's what we do here, at perfumology. We all sniff it. She's kind of new. You new to fragrances? Or new to niche fragrances? A little bit. Yeah, new new to niche fragrances. New to niche. Okay, yeah. she's new to niche. So. You know, as we all grew, we came to we came out of design and said we need something a little bit more intricate mm -hmm. than what we as for. So now she's in the right place, and y'all know she's in the right place. Y'all gonna find this kind of variation of niche anywhere in the city. Oh, not at all. I was looking. Not at all. Not at all. Not at close. <laughs> not at close. And great people, great, great situation can't be. And last but not least, the new BDK. Velvet Tonka is here. I can't wait to sniff it. Let's go. It smells exactly like it's supposed to smell. It smells like velvet. It smells smooth. It's just very smooth. Velvet Tonka, very smooth. Yeah, definitely, definitely nice and smooth. Mm. I like this. To me, is on the order of Gris Chanel for some reason. It's giving me the same type of vibe as Gris Chanel. It's not too pronounced. It's laid back, but you can smell it. So it reminds me of Greece, it reminds me of uh, it reminds me of a sweeter Greece Chanel, but smooth. And you get the sweetness of the Tonka, of course. I'm sure there's some. There's another sweetness of it. It's not just Tonka. There's something else in here. Is it aiding the sweetness? Vanilla. Yeah. Or it is vanilla and Tonka both in here. Probably. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Some almond. Oh yeah. Right. 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 Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, so Brian has mentioned almond. He said probably some vanilla in here. Haven't looked up the notes. I'm glad I'm getting to smell it for the first time here, though. So, uh, again, perfume miles. If you're trying to smell the new stuff, come right here. Now, I still, you know, other places are still hot, but they don't have the variation of deviations here at Perfumology. So make sure y'all come right here and check it out. 325 North 3rd Street in between Market and Arch. No, 25, not 325. Oh, it's just 25? Yeah, just 25 more third. What everybody been going past the show? Okay, 25. I don't know why, I forgot Market Street is the start. It's like Broad Street being 14th. All right, so 25 North 3rd Street 
And there's in Philly, PA. Y'all know where it is. You look at the address. Don't pay attention to me. Put the navy in the car and get down here and smell the stuff. I'm not sure if he wasn't. I'm not sure. Yeah. Yeah, this is nice. I guess looking for. Focus Talk is nice. Mm -hmm. I think we're talking about they have a new one in Initio. We don't have that much time, so I mean, to go through all of them is going to be difficult. But this is like a sweet cashmere, some fruit. Uh, Oh, musk therapy. She said musk? Yeah, but she said like a cashmere. Oh, not like musk therapy. Okay, not this musk. Mm -hmm. And this is musk therapy, the newer one. They probably got heat, heat on in here. Like the white bottle that had heat on in it. This, this, this is, trying. This is uh, like um, musk. Oh, definitely sweet. Violet. Definitely sweet. This is nice. Must therapy is nice. This is good, bro. Musk is a lot of different things. Which one? This must therapy is good. <laughs> Muscle fries. Musk intense. But it has like pear. Oh, pear and musk. Rose of Venus. Rose of Venus is the Ikaro. Really good. Oh, it's good. You can smell you can smell the, the rum with alcohol content. Yeah, it's uh, got a little smokier scent to it too, but uh, yeah. I guess nice. Nice. She was an anomaly. She was an anomaly. Rose is nice. No idea what this is, y'all. Yellow bottle. Jig off. Emma Beal. Or Emma Bile. Beal. A M A B I L E. Okay, interesting. Different. It's going to be a dry down piece, so It's going to be a dry down piece. You like that one? 
Should be small? Yeah, so that's yeah. amber and musk. Oh. It's amber, yeah. It's like um, in rocks and it's like five. I'm about to come down here and really give Giajov a sniffle. I think that's the next time I come down here, it's going to be all about Jijov. Maybe on vacation. All about Jijov. You need to make pretty bottles, man. Yeah, I know, right? Juice is kind of like, well, because it got Jijov on it, they're going to like it. Yeah, like Voja does, right? But uh, it's okay. I mean, the bottles are beautiful, but I got to get that a whole day sniff. I got to come down here on one of my days and just sniff out on the Jijov and really give my opinion because I started out this game with Jijov. But I'm talking about, you know, the, the, the shooting stars and the, and the ooh uh, collection, but from back in the day. And I'm, like I said, I'm over here when it comes to Jijo. I already smell the old head stuff. But uh, I'll smell this new stuff another time, but not today. Velvet Talk is pretty nice, though. Velvet Talk is pretty nice. Two or four of my favorites, but one doesn't do anything. You have Herbert Pure? Yeah, Herb, Herb Pure is great. I mean, yeah, one of the greatest, um, one of the greatest fragrances that uh, uh, Giorgio's ever made is Herb Pure. I remember back in the day, I was gonna buy that. It used to come in just the the, 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 the plastic bottle, or not really plastic, kind of ceramic bottle, with that I didn't have all the smoothness on it. There was only one that didn't have like the fur on it. All the other ones had the fur, from Allegro to all the ones you know I have, yeah, Melati and all this stuff. But the only one that didn't have that, but now. No, it had it has some fur on it, yeah. So, Herbert Pure is one of the greatest yeah, ever that uh, that Jojo ever made. It's really like, yeah. No, it's not. It's okay. Anyway, yeah, give it a spray. Go it see it; it'll linger. <clears throat> yeah, it definitely lingers. Yeah, the velvet top is pretty cool. I think I think the food is now. This is what I feel about it. Food is Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, I need to I got something for you. 
Okay, cool. Um, drop it in. All right, y'all. Hey, thank y'all for coming through. Make sure you like, subscribe, and share this channel. We're all talking about all perfumology today. Everything perfumology. I'll put it right there. I'll check it out. Perfumology, everything perfumology. Biz Wiz, thank you. What do you think about Mixed Emotions by Byredo? I actually, even though we're not in a Byredo store, I liked it. I did like it. It was really cool. And I don't even remember it, but I liked it. It's been like maybe a month since I smelled it. Hmm. And I remember liking it. So, yeah, it's pretty good. They got a partial of Vettel Katanka coming. What's your favorite Chris Collins? Well, it used to be, it used to be, um, I had two that I really liked from Chris Collins. It used to be dancing on um, Dance Africa. Oh, that, that's that's uh, Tickle Toes like that one. Wow. My favorite was Dance Savage, Dance Savage, and um and Harlem Nights. But now it is oh, Vida. Vida Kun Me. This is it, man. This is good. This is good. This will be my next Chris Collins bottle right here, right here. It is gorgeous and it wears forever. It lasts forever. But that's why it costs what it costs. 175, 450. 30 mil? 150, 50 mil. 175, so yeah. But it's definitely worth it. So that's the new Chris Collins. That's the one I like the most. And of course, the by Rudy. What, you get a Passe Soir? Passe Soir is good. That is, that is delicious. Oh, Passe Soir is good. Oh, my goodness. That is delicious. Citrus Rivera, too. Which one now? Citrus Rivera was the other one that I was thinking Oh, yeah, the citrus about. one? Yeah, I'm not really a citrus here, but it is good, though. Okay, let me check real quick downstairs. Okay. I'm more like an animalic type, deep note person. I do like those a lot. Yeah, I like ambers, and, you know, I like orientals, vanillas, and mm -hmm. things like that, but I like a little tobacco and stuff like that mixed in as well. Yes. You know, not like the complexity, y'all, I'm trying to make all those notes come together and make them smell like something. I like you the know. deep roses. Oh, definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Did you smell that rose over there? It's not really deep, deep, but it's not bad. Rose of Venus is not bad. Oh. Well, because it has the rum in it. It has a little rum thing going on with it. And as soon as I sprayed it, I was like, yeah, it's alcohol in here. Yeah, I love BDK, man. It's like one of my favorite. Oh, no doubt. She smelled that. She smelled the uh, rose. Which one, too? Oh, that's your Oh, this. Which one? That one? That's nice. Ain't it nice? nice this is nice. And on your skin, it'll smell better. I'm telling you, paper's not doing any justice. Put a little bit on your skin, on, on your pinky toe, or your, on your, your thumbnail, whatever. You might want to put some of that on your skin. What brand is this? This is a, it's a little niche perfume house out of San Francisco. Um, I think my only store that has these is on his online merch store. Okay, I like that. Yeah, yeah, Alright, y'all ready to go? Uh, it's your boy. I get in the car. I got to go home and go to sleep. I am tired of doing nothing all day. Oh, uh, you think? No, I think Velvetanka smells like Grisha now with fruit. Rouge smoke is totally different. Rouge smoke is it's all all Oriental gourmand, whatever. Because Oriental or gourmand could be both. But but no, uh, Velvetanka smells like Grisha now for me, but a little bit of um, fruit in it. It smells fruity. And do you have Napa Noir? I do have Napa Noir. And Napa Noir is good too. A real, real good uh, velvety leather. I have Napa Noir. In fact, I, I, used to, I sprayed it in my car just to give it that new car leather flavor, but from a fragrance. So uh, that's the last time I really sprayed it. But yeah, I have Napa Noir too. It's definitely something different. It's not your typical leather or suede, but it's going to be something that's different. So if you like leather and suede, but you don't want the same old you know, cherry bomb or them putting strawberry in it whatsoever is really a leather and a suede. I mean, like really, like a pair, like the inside of a pair of some, let's say some red bottoms, some really expensive leather shoes or really expensive leather bag. That's what it smells like to me, okay? All right, I gotta go. What do you, which one do you think has more almond in it? I don't know, I think the Tonka, the Velvet Tonka has some almond in it. I do think that's more almondy. If you if you're saying there's almond and root smoking, I'm not sure. I smell all sweet in that. But yeah, velvet tonka is nice. Like I said, if you smell Grishanal, you smell velvet tonka, but it's Grishanal, it got it got some uh, sweetness in it. You'll like it. I'd like to thank uh, everybody for coming through. And uh I got to go. All right. And look like perfumology got a new customer. It says good to go. 
and we out. Talk to you later. Uh, say bye bye. Say bye. Name one time. Stephanie. Stephanie, that's what I thought. Okay, Stephanie said bye bye. Her first debut on a YouTube channel with Perfect Miles. All right. Same, uh, Okay, very soon. I might be selling a couple bottles very soon. I'm not sure yet, but I'll let you know for sure. I'll let you know. I'll put up a post first, and then I'll go and do the sale. All right, talk to you guys later. Have a great night. Time for me to go sleep. Be grateful tomorrow.